How does a beloved TV host go from daytime darling to a symbol of controversy? Today, we're diving into Ellen DeGeneres' dramatic fall from grace, exploring how a single tweet sparked a series of events that changed her career forever. Welcome to World Fame Stories! In this video, we're taking a closer look at Ellen DeGeneres' rise to fame and her subsequent fall from grace. From a groundbreaking TV career to a series of scandals, Ellen's story is one of incredible highs and dramatic lows. Let's break it all down! Ellen DeGeneres was once the queen of daytime TV. She first gained national attention in the 1990s with her sitcom Ellen, where she made history as one of the first TV characters to come out as gay. Her courage led to a surge in popularity, culminating in a hit talk show in 2003. Her charm and relatability earned her a spot in Hollywood's elite, hosting big names like Oprah, Brad Pitt, and Taylor Swift. Ellen's first major backlash came in October 2019, when she was photographed enjoying a Dallas Cowboys game with former President George W. Bush. Critics pointed out that Bush supported policies opposing LGBTQ rights, questioning Ellen's commitment to her own values. Ellen responded by defending her friendship, saying, Be kind to one another means accepting people with different beliefs. But this message would soon come back to haunt her. In March 2020, comedian Kevin T. Porter's tweet asking four insane stories about Ellen being mean went viral. The tweet garnered 2,600 replies and exposed the darker side of Ellen that many had heard whispers about but never fully acknowledged. This tweet became a catalyst for widespread criticism. In January 2020, Nikki Tutorials, a trans beauty blogger, appeared on Ellen's show to discuss coming out as trans. But in February, she revealed that her experience wasn't as positive as she had hoped. This was one of the first public cracks in Ellen's nice persona. The criticism intensified during the pandemic when Ellen compared quarantine life to being in jail on her April 6, 2020 show. Her comments, made from her luxurious mansion, seemed out of touch with the hardships faced by everyday people, and many saw this as a sign of her insensitivity. In July 2020, BuzzFeed News published a bombshell report with allegations from current and former employees of the Ellen DeGeneres show. The expose revealed accusations of racism, bullying, and sexual harassment within the show's workplace. The backlash was fierce, with many celebrities and former staff members coming forward with their own stories. In response to the allegations, Ellen issued a formal apology and Warner Media launched an investigation. Executive producers Ed Glavin, Kevin Lehman, and Jonathan Norman were fired, and Ellen promised to address the issues. However, the damage was done. By March 2021, the Ellen DeGeneres show had lost over a million viewers, and Ellen announced her departure from the show. Ellen's final episode aired on May 26, 2022, after 19 seasons. She faced a lot of criticism, but also received support from some celebrities. Ellen later described the backlash as a coordinated misogynistic attack and chose to step away from the spotlight. Now, Ellen is set to release her second Netflix special later this year, but her comeback tour was recently canceled. The cancellations followed negative reviews and have left fans wondering what's next for the comedian. From her iconic role as Dory to her rise and fall in the TV world, Ellen DeGeneres' career has been a roller coaster of highs and lows. What do you think about Ellen's journey from beloved talk show host to controversial figure? Share your thoughts in the comments below, and don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more updates on the world of celebrities. Thanks for watching World Fame Stories!